hello guys welcome back to my channel so please ignore the state of me i'm not going to be looking very good in this video because it's right, story time i've got covid it's rubbish i've got the cough and temperature and headache and that but i was planning on doing some videos this week i was planning on vlogging getting my headshots done and the preparation for my headshots but I can't do that now because obviously I've got to stay inside I was going to vlog going to wireless I can't go to wireless I've got to stay inside so I'm absolutely gutted about that so yeah I'm stuck in my room and I thought that I would do a video basically about what I get up to in my isolation my family have all gone for PCR tests today and my one's being ordered obviously because I'm not allowed to leave the house because I've tested positive on a lateral flow test so my mum my dad and my brother are all out of like in the house and I've stuck in my room so I'm just gonna be showing you what I get up to like how I'm feeling right now I feel rough but I feel okay like I have got a cough and a headache and that but I don't feel like awful awful right now I'm currently eating uh nutella waffle and i've got hot chocolate because i kind of don't really fancy much food and i literally that's the only thing that i fancied about feeling a bit ill i'm really 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 worried about losing my taste and losing my smell that's my biggest fear right now i do not want to lose my taste and smell no 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 so it is day two of isolation and i've just had a bath and i've washed my hair and i'm gonna do my curly hair routine make myself feel a bit better I've got a bacon sandwich, let's see if I can taste it, I could taste breakfast, so let's see if I can taste this. I'm trying to keep myself as busy as I can, but I think if I keep busy then I won't feel as rough because I'm not thinking about it the whole time. But my cough has gotten worse today, but yeah, I'll keep you updated throughout the day and let you know what I'm doing. Day. I can still taste my food, yay! So today I've done a PCR test, I had a bit of a nap. Um, I literally just chilled, but I've got my dinner now. I've got pasta and frankfurters and some garlic bread. And I'm also watching the England game, and I'm going to watch the Love and Reunion later. So, it's all good and chilled. So, let's see if I can taste this now. Fingers crossed. I can still taste it. Great. So, guys, it's the next day now. Please ignore my spot. But I'm feeling rough today. Like, I'm still in my pyjamas. I've lost my smell, my taste of sugary. <laughs> I'm so sad about that, but yeah, I'm feeling rough today. I literally haven't got up. I'm going to try and do a bit of college work on my computer, which I've got out now. But other than that, literally doing nothing. It's just really boring. Like, I've got to be in here for like another seven days. Are you joking? I decided to get changed, so I thought it might make me feel a little bit better. And I didn't really get any college work done, but I've read a bit of a play, so I guess you could say I've had a bit, got a bit done. I just feel really rough. I've got nothing to do. Oh, my PCR test came back and it was positive, so definitely I've got COVID. I mean, I knew I did anyway because I have all my laterals here. So, yeah not doing anything got no taste got no smell might sleep <laughs> so guys it's tuesday and i'm feeling a lot better today actually still got all my symptoms and everything but i'm feeling a lot more energized and i've just come to sit outside i walked through my house with a mask on because obviously I don't want anyone else getting COVID, so I'm just sitting outside. So guys, it's later in the day, and you know, I felt fine earlier, but now I'm feeling very sick. Really weird, don't know why. I've done nothing today, I feel so like unproductive. I haven't done any college work, but I'm about to take another test to see if I'm negative yet. Very much doubt it, but let's have a little look and see. So guys, I literally haven't vlogged for a few days and that's because I haven't been feeling very well and there was no point to vlog. Today is Friday the 10th of September and I'm so upset because today I would have been going to wireless. I've had a little bit of a cry, that is the reality of isolation. I try to do my makeup to make me feel a little bit better 
but I'm now testing negative. I've still got to stay in my house until Monday because that's the day my isolation finishes. But I am testing negative now, so I feel a bit more comfortable walking around my house. So I think tonight I'm actually going to watch TV downstairs with mum and dad. Um, but today I am feeling a lot better than I have been other days. I've been having a really bad stomach pain and really bad headaches. But fingers crossed it seemed to have gone today. Oh, my friend Chloe dropped around some flowers for me the other day. My boyfriend sent me some um, sweets, like a big packet of sweets. So that was really nice of them. Onwards and upwards and just absolutely gutted that I can't go to wireless. And that is the reality. When you have COVID, you're missing out on things and you're very upset. <laughs> but I'm trying to get through it and I'm going to college at June four days, so I'm very excited. So guys, it is now Monday and my isolation is finished. I'm testing negative, I'm allowed to leave the house, I've got college tomorrow. And this whole experience has been one that I never want to ever, ever, ever do again. Like, isolation was horrible. I hated not being, like, being able to hug my mum and dad. It just wasn't a very nice experience. And obviously, I was feeling ill. I'm still not, like, 100%, but I'm feeling a lot, a lot, lot better than I did. But, yes, yeah, so this is the end of the vlog. Anyone who's in isolation, some tips that I'd give you is just to keep yourself busy. Try to be productive every day. Even if you're not productive, just try to, like be productive in some way or another and another thing try to get dressed like i know a lot of people think i'm in isolation i'm stuck in my room let's stay in my pajamas no i got dressed every day and it made me feel a lot better and a lot more like lively like i could actually do things yeah getting dressed keeping yourself busy and obviously like everyone just be safe and if you're feeling really really ill go to hospital uh, thank you for watching this video and joining me on my isolation journey i hope that you enjoyed um but yeah, I will see you all next time for another video.